Whoa! Just want to take out the... These guys are not endlessly respawning, right? What the heck was that, dude? Shoot like 20 arrows. Come on, one at a time. One at a time. Oh my. Ah! Yo, Cooper. Thank you for the gifted subscriptions. Thank you, thank you. And that goes for everybody. Thank you as well. With subscribing, giving out gift subs, dropping some bits, or just watching. It. It's much appreciated. Don't always get the, the downtime to say it because I'm focused on having bad takes about the Canadian legal system instead. But thank you. That was the invader. I just punched him in the kidneys until he died. Mike Tyson. <laughs> we look like a, like a famous person. Like a We look like a very famous old man. Like, it's an old man's face. No, not, not John Voight. Not Boris Johnson. It's like a really old guy. Like, as... No, not the mayor of Whoville. That's Jeffrey Tambor. Not... Not the Venga Buzz dude from the Six Flags ads. Hey. No, he's like old old. He's not like a little old. I'm talking about like, like a 90 year old. He does not look like the guy who played Vision. Paul Bettany is like 45 years old and handsome and in incredible shape. Alright, this is not a great time to have Sastis. <laughs> Yeah, just take me. This is a tough one. <laughs> I think we're going to get there, but this is a tough one. Herschel from The Walking Dead. No, it's like, he's got like a really... His forehead is average size, but then his mouth and jaw are like so small. I think he was in the water, boy. He does kind of look like the I think you should leave car focus group guy. I hate to say it, but I can I can see the Clint Eastwood reference. I, I, that's not who I'm thinking of. But I can see it. Okay, get me out of here. I 
I'm okay. We gotta be like a little faster, which is very scary. They're, they're coming to life, dude. Don't breathe fire on me, I gotta get up close. Dude, I'm telling you, this is like randomizer worthy. Once we get, oh no. Once we get a little extra economy, it's okay. But this is almost like randomizer, randomizer level jank. Might be easy. Oh, what a move, though. I didn't think you had it in you. Oh, no, no, no. No, no, no. Okay, drink up. It's just one gargoyle, dude. Just one way far thin gargoyle. Quick life gem. Then Pugilist. Oh, uh, the camera hit me. Run. Don't rush me. Don't rush me. All right. <laughs> It's also the last piece of kimbap. Let's go. Oh. It's not Clint Howard, okay? I understand the similarity, but... Ninja Zombie, thank you as well for the gifted subs. Thank you, thank you. Mm. Bunny, 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 bunny. Um. No, no, no. Lost Bastille, Macduff's workshop. And buy some freaking large titanite, dude. Yeah, 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 whatever. You know, that's like a you thing. I'm not really that concerned about it. I've never had kimbap. They look like maki rolls to me. Listen. Kimbap, slightly different. We've covered some of the semantic differences earlier in today's lesson. Little, little gross tongue, tongue flick to try to get uh, some of the grains of rice out of my mouth. You gotta upgrade your turtle bod. Oh, I forgot. People told me there's a good reason to upgrade your armor in this game. We out of shards, boys. He doesn't have any more left. We bought them all. 
That armor? Maybe not. Well, it's the only armor we're wearing, so... We're gonna find a way to make it work. You didn't buy all of the Titanite? Alright. Would you care to make a wager? I will shut up forever now, I'm sorry. No, that's not fair. You're just wrong. You could just be like, I'm sorry. You don't have to be like, fine, I'll never talk again forever. Vorgel the Sniper. Well, that's bad. <laughs> They didn't, they didn't, uh, anticipate me just having two fists here, huh? Really thought there would be a weapon with, uh, some reach. So here's what I'm thinking. Yeah, yeah. So I'm hoping that Vorgel can figure out how to climb the ladder. And we could have, like, a fair fight up here. I mean, this is hell. I don't even think I can jump, dude. <laughs> the ladder's in the way. Capra strats! Endlessly punching the wall over and over. Come on, man. That's just... Like, that's just stupid. <laughs> you gotta give it a try. I'm gonna taste the stupid freaking idiots. It did nothing? It hit nothing. Switch to another weapon temporarily? Absolutely not. Um. Hey, uh, by the way, I know you're saying dual plunging attack. If I could dual plunging attack, I'd be all over this. You, you can't do a plunging attack because of the freaking ladder. I'm thinking, like, maybe... You can switch to a plunging attack on the ladder. <laughs> well... <laughs> it looks cool. I definitely think this will actually work. As stupid as it is.
And it might take a couple of tries. Just climb! This might be one where we just leave. I mean, I have no this regret. I have like a little bit of... this annoyance at a room like this one. Just climb, dude! You're pressing the... Okay, we're not gonna do this area. It's really more of a matter of principle than anything else. Um, <laughs> I could obviously switch to a sword and kill them, but that's stupid, in my opinion. So I think we gotta go to this place. Uh, where'd the lady go? No, my waifu. Oh, she's in Majula now. She's in the roundel. What is that? She's at the door with the light orb above it. Ah, yeah. You're in the gulag. NPC is bingo fuel. Hello, ma'am. Oh, hello. This room. Yeah, yeah, I know. Can I have it? Yeah, it would be nice. Kind of a little light on souls, you know. That made me very uncomfortable. Please stop this. Well, just give me the thing then. Please stop this. Oh no! Yo, she's so powerful. Look at her HP, dude. Oh my god. Yo, Kate, are you downloading uh, Warzone? We can beat her. At least it's just one enemy. It's not 8,000 dogs. It's free, right? It is free. It's, let me tell you, on, on Battle.net, it's Call of Duty Modern Warfare. But don't buy it. If it says you gotta buy it, then it's, uh, it's wrong. And I've made a mistake. Dude, I think I gotta restart the whole game. It is a big download, but honestly, it probably won't take that long. I don't know if you want to do it tonight or just at some point in the future, but... Yo, if she's so powerful, why couldn't she kill the Dragon Rider? You ever consider that? What did this girl do? Talk back. Uh, she wanted to... I mean, she just spoke to me rudely. And then tried to sell me something that I didn't have the money to pay for. I felt like she didn't... 
speak to me with the respect that I thought I deserved. She only wanted 2,000? I thought she wanted 20,000, dude. I'm just waiting for the interrupt. So you try to do something, and I punch you. Is that the heck is that, dude? No, no, oh, he's got that dirty Dark Souls two style beat, dude. Wow, she's tough. <laughs> My strategy for uh, defeating her is press LB. <laughs> hey Siri, what's 10 million to the power of 10 million? I know that, um, that sounds familiar, doesn't it go like, one zero 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 Yeah, dude, that's that's that dirty Sean Wasabi beat right there. It goes. A milli, a milli, a milli. I feel like we're about to go to a forest where we see a bunch of ghosts. Is that true? Leave me alone. I'm interested in one thing, dark. I'm interested in one thing, dark, you have in the gift. Hold on, hold on, say it again. Leave me alone. I'm interested. Hold on, do it again. Leave me alone. I'm interested in one thing, dark. It's Apollo! It's Apollo IRL! Leave me alone. I'm interested in one thing, dog. I told you I don't watch shows with orcs in them. Huntsman's Copes. Yo, I've ne there's a boss here I've never fought. It's in the, the circular area. The, the gladiatorial area. I remember not loving this area. We'll see how it goes. Yeah, yeah, the chariot. This is the dawning of the age of the chariot. He's just vibing. If you've never fought it, how do you remember? Because it's an optional boss that you just run... You just run by. I feel like there's like a necromancer in here. Yeah, yeah, there's some kind of poison garbage man. Spits green goo on you. Majula. Haida. Ooh, I wanna see you at the sinners rising next to Huntsman's Copes. That's where the next bonfire is, if I remember correctly. I'll see you at the Huntsman's Copes. We'll get there fast, and then we'll take it slow. Hello. That's very polite of you to wait. I thought I heard some steps there. Hey, 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 hey. No, no, no. No toxic darts, please. Oh my god. No, no, no. You broke those with brand new windows! 
Oh my god. You got me. Didn't anticipate the door having it. Ah, yep, okay, you got me. You really got me, Jane. Oh, what? Nobody's gonna bust through the bars and get me? Nice try. I learned to check my corners. Oh my god, dude. Come on, man. Come on. <laughs> Oh, no, 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 no. The gift. The gift. <laughs> giant frog? This isn't giant frog, right? This giant frog is in the shrine of Amanda. This is like demon horse, right? Will you use other weapons at some point? <laughs> Have you ever heard of the expression, if it ain't broke? Or if it is broke even, don't fix it because it'll be funny? Well. That a kick in the teeth. <laughs> Parkour. I love it. So I know I have been talking a lot about talk, but it's just, this is merely using talk as an as an anecdote enabler. Um, when I posted the video of like. You know, you're gonna be high forever. Somebody replied, Nightmare! 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 And just... Made me, uh... I laughed out loud for like... Probably 200 full seconds. <laughs> I was... I was having a great time. Yo, that's the demon of song, my man. Well... Easy mode. Drink up, brother! It's a scary time. Press E on a wall again? This shit is getting ridiculous, dude. <laughs> Are you kidding me? What were they thinking? You could just walk over it? It's like it was designed by a bull's proctologist after a night of eating lamb vindaloo. It's an ice cream sundae with grandpa's chocolate syrup after taco night. AVGN is kind of wholesome in a crass way. I agree. I actually, like, you know, I watched probably, like, the first, I don't know, at least the first 50 AVGNs. I think he's, I think he's a funny guy. But it is still fun to make fun of it a little. It's a different era. Nobody was making videos back then. The first 130? I'm trying to think of like what the last one I remember watching was.
but I don't remember. Is this where we? Ca this is where we came from. I watched some of the the board James stuff too. It's just you know he's like a passionate dorky guy, and uh, you know it, it's he he makes good content when it's uh, stuff that he's passionate about. Like, the older I get, I get, the more I'm like, I don't really care about the character. But this dude talking about, like, practical gore effects, I'm like, that's interesting to me. Amazing. Just a, a true battle of the legends here. That's it? The board, James. <laughs> oh no. I mean, if you're like one of the angry reviewers, it's kind of natural, right? Like, you got to evolve or like get bored with it. Like, at some point, you're like, I covered like the. T I made a video about the room. I made a video about, like, um, Beastmaster 2. I made a video about, like, all this. All the ones you gotta make a video of. What? Where the hell do I go from there? Push tree. Ah, this tree. So I feel like, like eventually, you just get like, it's way more interesting to hear somebody like that kind of like break character and talk about what they actually like than to be like, oh, I hope they do a video on, you know, Freddy Prince Jr.'s Wing Commander. I mean, what were they thinking? Two seconds ago, he was in the cockpit and now he's in the brig? Did he travel at light speed? It's a little bit of an unfair kind of generalization, but... <laughs> you. Yo, you guys want a, a good bit? Here I am, doing everything I can. Okay. Forgot about this guy. You, where's the good bit? I thought you said a good bit. That's fun. You know, at least I'm not walking through poison, and instead, like, the poison's kind of falling on me. That's, that's different. There's another big man around here. I recall. Oh, what? Where did you come from, brother? Oh, you're just like a little baby. You don't even have any armor, dude. He's the huntsman. It's his copes. See, this feels to me like I ain't ever been here before. What are you? Hey, hey, you're just beating me, beating me senseless with reeds. <laughs> oh, this is the horse run up. Let's go. Yo, give me one moment too. I need to, uh, I need to download what I'm gonna be playing next.
because we are going to go for one extra hour. If you're cool with it, Kate, we're going to be going for one extra hour to play some uh, of our bounty game. But I just realized I'm offline on Steam, so I'll have to download it before we get started there. But it should only take, like, a very small amount of time. game until I'm sure that we're doing the bounty. You know? I don't want to give them any exposure for free. <laughs> oh. It's gotta be... It's gotta be value on my end or no fucking deal. Sure, whatever. Just poison me. If it pleases. Oh, hello. It's not great. Maybe it's okay. Ah, okay. No, no, it's bad. Honestly, he froze me. He froze me like a Wanda Dregler fastball. It's ridiculous. Everybody knows she's famous for her slider. Oh. That's bad. That's bad. We don't take those. We don't take those. This is definitely, like, how you die. Oh, really? You're both gonna make it around at the same time? <laughs> I thought I had a genius strat. Today's episode of Super Mega Baseball 3 was crispy. And your next one's supposed to be even better than that? You know what Shaggy said. It wasn't me. <laughs> what was today's score? You can spoil it. Fifteen? Fifteen to one? <laughs> Uh, <laughs> child's play. Sure. Whoop. Just hit him with your fist, dude! Yeah, I think Malph and I should play higher than 45. I think we should play on like, uh... Maybe on like 60? And then it... Yo, he do be fast, though. He do be fast, though. Dude. <laughs> it's like he was like... Oh, shit. I was, I was supposed to be down there. I didn't expect he'd get there this fast. Seem to remember being ambushed here. Something about this area just smells like being ambushed. Ah. 
Why do they sound like Rob's Fat Albert impression? Hey, hey, hey. I'm trying to keep the counting sheep. I forgot there was a bonfire here, sorry. Pursuer? Oh, you, that's it. It's the barrels. The barrels that mock us. It's not in here. It's my mistake. It's my mistake. And I'm so confused about what to do. Where are you going, dude? It's behind me? Sometimes I want to throw it all away. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> you gonna make me go up there? Amazing. Hey, hey. <laughs> Dude, I'm with you. Like, I I love a little bit of jank. I hate good games. I love games that are, they have a lot, like, hey, here's a fucking weird idea. What if the barrels, like, laugh at you and kill you? Sure, why not, dude? A lot of people are gonna hate that shit, but sounds like it... Sounds like it could be fun. It's got character, you know? It's got character. I'm gonna make this jump, and then we'll probably uh, pivot a little early. So that we can get the bounty in in time. You will not make this jump, you jackass. I think you can still do a Fat Albert reference. As long as after you do the reference, you go, remember Bill Cosby? Fuck that, dude. What a, what a dick. What a piece of garbage. As long as you put that there, it's like the same when you're like, man. You know, if you talk about like a movie that Harvey Weinstein worked on. You could be a like, great movie. Executive produced by a real piece of shit. But like the movie is good. You just add what a dick to the end. I agree. Yeah, dude, same with Kevin Spacey. I agree. Chinatown, sure. I mean, I haven't seen Chinatown, but I'm... <laughs> He's not in Chinatown. Yeah, but Chinatown's... Directed by Roman Polanski is, uh, you know. I'm aware Kevin Spacey is not in Chinatown. He would have been like, <laughs> like 11 years old. I mean, I gotta admit, bad man, great actor. But at 11, I don't think he had honed his craft yet. Get over it, Jake. It's Chinatown. Honestly, it was worth it for a Pharos Lockstone, I think. First try. Hello, Rukai.
now what? Now I'm gonna log off from Dark Souls 2. I'm gonna log on to Steam. Download the thing I'm supposed to download. Check check on my wife and see what she wants her plans to be for the evening. And then I will return to you and see what the heck is going on.